Hi all, in this lecture we are discussing about 7th segment decoder that is BCD to 7th segment decoder. So through this lecture I am discussing about what is a 7th segment decoder, where it is used and how we can draw the truth table of a 7th segment decoder. So 7th segment decoder are used to display decimal numbers. So 7th segment decoders are used in our calculators data banks and uh, our digital watch digital watch also we are using seven segment decoders so here there are seven segments one two three four five six and seven and these are arranged in a format of eight this look like an uh, look like the digit eight this is segment a and this is segment b this is segment b this is segment C, this is segment D, this is segment E, this is segment F and this is segment G. So this is my 7 segment display. This is my 7 segment display and uh, each are A, B, C, D, E, F and G. If I want to display uh, the decimal 1 I have to turn on these two LEDs B and C and remaining LEDs will be off. Then I can display the digit 1. So here the inputs are BCD numbers, BCD digits and I write it as A, B, C and D. And also uh, I am writing here as A, B, C and D. And uh, here we are using seven LEDs and that is A, B, C, D, E, F and G. Here also I am writing A, B, C, D, E, F and G. This is our LED display and here we are using seven LEDs. This is LED A, okay. this is LED B and LED C, LED D, LED E, LED F and LED G. So next we are writing the true table. So in this table uh, here we are writing the decimal number. Decimal number 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. Uh, this is its binary equivalent. 0 can be represented as 0, 0, 0, 0. 1 can be denoted as 0, 0, 0, 1, 2, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 1, 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 1, 0, 0, 0, and 1, 0, 0, 1. Next, we are writing the seven segment equivalent, seven segment display uh, corresponding to this decimal value. So, first of all, I have to display the digit zero. Uh, my LED display is like this. Seven segment display is like this. If I want to display zero, this is A, this is B, this is C, this is D, E, F, and G. So if I want to display 0, I have to turn on A, B, C, D, E, F and I have to turn off the LED G. Then I can display 0. So I am writing uh, A, LED A, LED B, LED C, LED D, LED E, LED F will turn on and I have to write 0 for LED or I have to turn off the LED G. Similarly, if I want to turn, uh, display the decimal value 1, I have to turn on these two LEDs B and C and I have to turn off the remaining LEDs. So I can write here as 0, uh, I have to turn on B and C and turn off the remaining LEDs. Similarly, if I want to display the uh, digit, uh, the decimal 2, I have to turn on, I have to turn on 
uh, A, then B, then G, then E, and then D. Then I can display the decimal 2. So the remaining LEDs will be turned off. So I can write uh, turn on A, turn on B, turn on turn off C, turn on D, turn on E, and turn off F, and turn on G. Similarly, we can write uh, the seven segment display value for every decimal values. If I want to display three, I have to turn on A, B, uh, G, A, B, G, C, A, B, G, C, and uh, D. Remaining, I have to turn off. I have to turn off E and F. If I want to display 4, the digit 4, 4 is like this, 4 is like this, this, we can see 4 like this in our calculator. So I have to turn on F, B, G and C. Remaining, I have to turn off. B1, uh, G, G1, F1, uh, then C1 C1 okay I already put C1 B1 G1 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 remaining I have to make marks 0 similarly I completed the entire table if I want to write the boolean equation for <coughs> E if I want to write the boolean expression for E so I am considering where E becomes 1 so E becomes 1 for this value then E becomes 1 here then E becomes 1 E becomes 1 here then E becomes 1 for the decimal 8 so in these four cases for decimal value 0 for decimal value 2 decimal value 6 and decimal value 8 the E becomes 1 so we can write the value for E as uh, E is equal to A bar, B bar, C bar, D bar plus A bar, B bar, C here, here, A bar, B, C, D bar, A bar, A bar, B, C, D bar and here it is a bar a b bar c bar d bar plus a b bar c bar d bar similarly we can find the expression for a b c uh, d f and g like this uh, where it is one and corresponding binary uh, we have to mark and uh, we can write the boolean expression corresponding to that i hope all of you understand this topic we'll meet on next video Thank you.